yeah we're going to multi-nest design in the part two or the nest of our roofless duplex design that we are working on in the last uh, tutorial we were able to design this uh, floor ground floor plan which is one of our priority so what we do here is that i want to create the concept for this particular project for now before we later went on to do the a proper design procedure by using so this is what we are saying so this is actually where we are going to and we are going there with details so i want you to follow us too so the next thing that we want to do is to design the level two which is a proper flow and you if you are the one that have never been subscribed to this channel before kindly subscribe to our channel at the same time like this particular project and help us to share among people of like mind so let us start the project entirely so you can click on this architecture and say what so what we do is that uh, most of these are going to be of a cantilever developing so how do i mean by that is that most of these are not going to follow this line entirely because when you look at it from the original where uh, we say we are going to do that effectively so what I'm doing is that I want to do this from an uh, extensive aspect. So I'm going to use cantilever of what? Of 800. Let it be in that manner. So from this uh, particular one again, let me just have it done through. Good. So from here again, I'm having it. So I want to join this one together. So the reason is best known that okay there's cantilever in this or this area. So that is what we are doing. So as we have done with this one now, the next thing is that I want to take this one in between. So the cantilever here, the wall here are going to be aligned with this. So the reason being is that the same procedure of what we are seeing in the earlier the earlier picture. So how we are able to get the aspects we are going to follow them one after the other. So we are getting this one in place. So this one itself is going to be aligned with the original one. So click on this and say align to the original concept. So the same thing here, you close this door wall. So we want to create two rooms at the at this top, which is our priority. So where will this tile be? This guy is going to be what a closer. So the staircase is very important to note. So the staircase is still going to maintain its own uh, parameter so you do that in place and you click here to pieces this uh, this particular then extend this to come here so this one is done the staircase is being uh, created you still need to drag it down so the reason why you drag it down is that it gives spaces to where space is supposed to be as you have it, this one now, everybody will have access to their own particular room to go. So this one is going to be developed in a later time. So you extend this again, as I've said, extend it down, extend this one down as well. As we have done with this one, so this is going to be served as a closet, while this one is served as a uh, exit to the balcony, and the room is going to be there because it's going to be a fantastic, a big room. So room number one and room number two for sure so now you click here and say create and you say create you create a, a bathroom for this particular room at the same time you create bathroom for this particular room good so when this enter here and this one comes here so actually this might little serve as a madam room but this one child for the kid and the master room is going to be at the last place at the edge so the madam is going to have a balcony of her home which is very compulsory and necessary because that is the entire stylist of what of modern day design when it comes to the serious beauty so as we have done with this one this one is going to be like a closet so what we need to do here is that we choose an architecture then close here and choose the from the this particular door and put it here so good this is a door for so escape this one just like an exit 
so from this door click on door again and you select a normal door that will take you take care of you come to a few other space so now you do this and you say door here and door goes here so when you enter from the staircase let up in the staircase uh, line to that place so you say copy and you come here and you say please come to fee or please to align to the same the current fee so this one will be here so just to represent and you have gone so the next one is that this staircase is still going up so we have done with this so this one is going to be room so what we did to do here is to create the uh, floor plan then you start doing the selection of the plan growth a uh, ground floor plan too so this one is going to come outside sorry this is not this is going to come outside because it's not going to stay eating because this is going to serve as a balcony to walk around on the whole entire building so this one is going to be there as well So you get so if you finish then issue you have an issue somewhere so okay you need to close this and say finish so when you close that so you come here and you open this place but this is going to be a surface as a service toilet and from there someone who here can have access to the balcony again So here click and say sorry return this work and say click and say double click so you have this particular exit to the balcony as well why this maintain the whole space so another bed is another bed so from here now you can now come with the components and see bed to come so if you have more bed that can take a space then rather than this particular kind of bed design if i love this graphics that's why i'm using it's just one of my best uh, template that i downloaded long ago so you can put this one here so later enough furniture shall be here so everything is going to be what super natural so we're going to get that aspect right so the next thing is that you look at the uh, see door at the door you select um, your, your toilet door which is going to be here and another toilet door which is going to be here also be here anywhere you like to put it it will be there another wardrobe is going to be situated here so finish and we're going to have what a closet of a good fit so how do we create that closet this is what we do so we create we use annotation for now because everything you are still coming back to detail them one after the other so i employ you not to not to be on the folder side so take your time and watch this tutorial of a great benefit with you as an architect if you're an interior designer all this particular process are what are what you are what of you following so this is it so we have this and we have this so we can place similar at the same time have this as well YouTube so we're done we're done with this and we have what we have in space that we need thank you for watching so the next aspect that we are going to create a total overhauling and everything is going to set for you